questions for me. I think it's shocking they're so far behind. I think it's absolutely shocking. They're five points behind City. Behind Chelsea, I'm talking about. Okay. I think they should be. They should be title contenders. They had a, a very comfortable start to the season and made an absolute mess of it, a complete hash of the whole thing. They had a poor window in my mind in terms of leaving it so late to buy all these players. You know, the money was there. They kept telling everyone the intent was there. They got Van Gaal. Okay, you had the World Cup, but they could have sorted things out a lot quicker. Than, and that, that, if, if you're planning a season, you look at that start to the season, they could have been five points clear after a few games. They, mm. they could have won all their opening games. And I think the injury list has, got, has gone, gone far too far now. It's not just bad luck. There's something else going on. You, don't, you can't get that many injuries. Is that right, club. Michael? Yeah, it is, yeah. You think I there's do, a, a, yeah. a root problem yeah, I think inside the club? And we just touched on it before. I think when you look at you know, the great Arsenal teams, we used to play against Arsenal and think, these lads play every single week. They're faster than us, stronger than us. They play more often and never get injured. And you just think, how, what are they doing? And how times have changed is what I also exactly. think. <laughs> but there are certain clubs that permanently get a lot of injuries. And I think you have to, you know... Forget about luck. You have to really check on what you're doing and, and condition your players in a, in a certain way. But I agree with with um, with Jason. I think it's it's a it's a real poor season so far for United. They've had a relatively easy start. They should be right up there near mm. top of the league. Will they have a say in this type They've of race? They've got no as it goes say in this. None of